Tribal Council went about as well as it could have gone. I used my idol successfully, and Jasmine and I managed to take out Brooke, who seemed to be the person running the show on the uh, other alliance. So that's good. Uh, the bad news is I'm still on the bottom, so unless something changes, I'm probably going home if I don't win immunity. Well, that went terribly. Yeah. Yeah, it really did. So Sydney plays an idol. Fine. It's whatever. I was prepared for an idol play, but, um... I wasn't prepared for an extra vote. I guess I should have been. That explains why there's only seven votes at the Taylor Tribal Council. But I thought we were fine. I really thought it wasn't going to be Brooke. You know, I thought we had all the bases covered. Instead, they make this big move, and, um... I just lost one of my allies. So that sucks, but... At least it wasn't Max who got voted off. Well, I guess we just gotta try again. Hope she doesn't win immunity. Yeah. Ugh. And if she does, we can just vote Jasmine. Yep, that sounds like a plan. Sydney keeps dodging eliminations. It's annoying. She should be gone by now, but she's still kicking around. Ah, well. If she doesn't win immunity, she's gone. If she does win, her ally's going home. She can't keep dodging the vote forever. One of these times it's gonna land on her. And then, you know... She'll be out of here. So in the grand scheme of things, I don't think that vote was terrible for us. No, I agree. I think it actually kind of helped. So are we on, like, the same page? Well, if that page involves flipping to Jasmine and Sydney, then yes. Yeah, we just don't... We're just... We have no future with these guys, right? We're on the bottom. Yeah, but uh, we still need one person to flip with us for a majority. So it's clear that Jasmine and Sydney are the two players on the bottom. But once they're gone, it's going to be Seth and it's going to be me going home. Last Tribal Council, we didn't have the numbers to make something happen. So, uh, we didn't. This round, however, there's nine people left, five's majority. If we can just get one person from that main five to flip with us, we'll have the numbers. The question is, who's going to be willing to do that? That Tribal Council went amazing. Yeah, I thought it wasn't going to. When you played the idol, I thought I was going home. Ah, but you weren't. Yeah, but I could've. If I didn't play the extra vote, I was gone. Well, it all worked out, but, um, we're still kind of on the bottom. Yeah, that's true. So, at Tribal Council, I played my extra vote because I felt like I needed to. It turned out I did. Sydney played her idol as well, so we're all out of advantages. And, um, you know, I think our placements just improved from 10th and 9th to 9th and 8th, but, uh, who knows, maybe things will change. That was some move you two pulled off at Tribal Council. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Um, what are you guys up to? Well, we, um, we kind of want to work with you guys again. Oh, really? Yeah, well, we only voted for Sydney because there was no other option. We didn't know, like, what was going to happen. Well, that's fair enough, I guess. Yeah, it's clear that we're the four on the bottom. Hmm. So Seth and Rick want to come back and work with us. That's good. It's a start, but we need another member. Like, it's not going to be Jack or Max. They dislike Jasmine. They'll vote her off. It's not going to be Toby, Morgan, or Rebecca because they want to get rid of me. So that leaves nobody. <laughs> well, we got four votes here, so who's going to be our fifth? Yeah, that's the hard part. Any suggestions? Well, maybe Rebecca. I feel like Rebecca or Morgan would probably be the most likely to flip, but it's a bit of a stretch. Yeah, I know. Looks like Rick and Seth are off chatting with the enemy. Yeah, it does look that way, doesn't it? Hmm, they're probably thinking of flipping. Well, why would they flip? Uh, you know, it's kind of obvious that there's a good four here, and they're kind of on the bottom of it. Yeah, hmm. Well, even if they flip, we still have the numbers. So, I'm lying down in the shelter, and I hear the rest of the Alliance chatting. And Jack says, there's a good four here. And I'm like, what? Okay, is this implying that I'm the fifth string in this Alliance? Because if so, that's not exactly great. So, I was thinking, maybe Sydney wasn't the best vote tonight. Well, who would we do instead? Like, Rick or Seth? No, I, I was thinking Jasmine. Jasmine? Why Jasmine? Well, that side could have an idol. Remember, Max, when uh, Seth got everyone together and we went on an idol hunt? Well, yeah, I remember that. None of us found anything. That's right, so Jasmine could have the idol? Exactly. 
if they have an idol, they're going to play it on Sydney. So uh, we should just load the votes on Jasmine and tell Rick and Seth to Sydney. And if they are really not with us, you know, we'll know. Jack thinks it'll be smarter if we all vote Jasmine this round. Honestly, I'm not going to complain. I want Jasmine gone. So if that's what happens, I'm fine with it. Welcome, survivors, to your next immunity challenge. This one's a classic. It's trivia. I'm going to ask you guys questions about the season's location, Madagascar, and the answers will be true or false. If you think the question is false, you go to the red square. If you think the answer is true, go to the green rectangle. If you get a question wrong, you're out. Last one standing wins immunity. First question. Madagascar is officially known as the Republic of Madagascar. True or false? Everyone's saying true, except for Morgan, Max, and Jasmine who say false. The correct answer is true. Next question. True or false? Madagascar is located in the South Atlantic Ocean. Everyone says false except for Toby. If the answer is true, then Toby wins immunity. The correct answer is false. Toby, you're out. Next question. True or false? The lemur is the national animal of Madagascar. Looks like we got a split. Rick, Jack, and Rebecca say false. Seth and Sydney say true. Correct answer is true. That means Rick, Jack, and Rebecca are out. Okay, final two. Your next question is, true or false? Madagascar was once a colony of France. Seth is saying true. Sydney is saying false, which means someone's about to win immunity. The correct answer is true, which means Seth has won himself a spot in the final eight. Congratulations, Seth, on winning immunity. Guaranteed a one in eight shot of winning this game. As for the rest of you, tribal council tonight, where somebody will be voted off and become the second member of our jury. Won't be you. All right, got nothing else for you guys. Grab your stuff, head on back. I'll see you tonight. How in the world did I win that challenge? I guess I'm like half those questions, but uh, I'm not complaining. A win's a win. Impressive win there, Seth. Well, I thank you. So um, what's, what's the plan? Well, it's staying the same, obviously. Sydney lost, Sydney's going home. Yeah, it should be, uh, you know, seven strong. Let's try this vote again. Exactly. Seth winning isn't a huge deal. I would rather the uh, immunity stay within my main alliance, but hey, at least Sydney didn't win. At least Jasmine didn't win. So it's all good. Tonight, Jasmine's going home, um, unless they got an idol. And if they do, they're not going to play it on her. There go Rick and Seth to chat with the others. Yeah, I wonder who they're gonna vote. Yeah, who knows. Nice job in the challenge, Seth. Why, thank you. So, uh, what's the plan gonna be tonight? Honestly, I'm not sure. Do you guys think we can flip Rebecca? Maybe. I feel like we need to vote whoever she wants to vote. Like, if someone's gonna flip, we need to make them feel like they're in charge, you know what I mean? Yeah, I guess so. But we still have to make someone flip. If the person we're banking on to flip is Rebecca, then I feel like I'm screwed. Like, she doesn't like me. She's already tried to get rid of me. So, uh, you know, I'm going to hope she flips. I'm going to try to get her to flip. If she doesn't flip, then I'm going home. So it's Jasmine who we're voting, yes? Yeah, that's the plan. And what do you guys think of that? Well, I'd rather it be Sydney, but Jasmine, it, it makes sense, I guess. Yeah, I feel the same way. Huh. <sighs> Why, you got a problem with it? I don't know, it's just I feel like Jack and Max are just telling us what to do and we're going along with it. Well, I don't know. That's how the game works sometimes, you just go with the numbers. I don't know where Rebecca's head's at right now. She seems to have second thoughts about voting with Jack and Max, which makes no sense. Because right now, me, her, and Toby are in the best spot. We can go to the final five of this alliance, and then just cut Jack and cut Max and get to the end. So, um, I don't see what she's complaining about. So you're fine with the Sydney vote? Yeah, man, if that's what's happening. Um, well, not to push anything on you, but it's kind of clear who's on the bottom after Sydney and Jasmine. 
Yeah, I agree with that. Mm-hmm. It's me and Seth, and then after we go home, who's gone, going home in fifth place? I don't know. Who do you think? I think you're in the next on the chopping block, honestly. Like, you're in a pretty bad spot. Yeah, I know. So, if you want to flip, tonight's the night to make a big move. We can take a shot at one of the people in power. Cut Jack, cut Max, whoever. Whoever you want. Whoever I want. Yeah. Tonight, I need to get Rebecca on my side. Simple as that. If she sides with us, there's five votes. If she doesn't, then, well, I could easily be the next to go, so... Tonight, I'm just counting on her to side with us. Well, to tell you the truth, Rick, I wouldn't mind, you know, going against Jack and Max. Well, that's great. So we're voting Jack? Um, I don't know. I mean, it would be nice to get out his ally. Take a shot at Max. What do you say? Hey, if that's what you're doing, I'm doing that too. As of right now, I feel like the biggest threats are probably Sydney. Jack and Rick. And all of them have their little number ones, right? Cindy's got Jasmine, Rick has Seth, and Jack has Max. So tonight I'm putting myself in a position where I can take out, you know, someone's number one. I can either cut off Sydney's right hand, or I can cut off Jack's right hand. And I'm the swing vote, so I can do whatever I want. And the question is, what do I want to do? Hey, Jack. Hey, Morgan. What's going on? Um, well, honestly... I think Rebecca's having second thoughts with the vote. Well, what do you mean? I don't know. I'm just not entirely sure she's going to vote with us. Huh. Going into tonight, I'm expecting Seth and Rick to flip. And if one more person flips, I could get voted off. So, Rebecca, you need to get your act together. You need to get back on our side. Hey, Rebecca. Hey, Jack. How's it going? It's going fine. How about you? How are you feeling about tonight? Uh, I feel fine. Yeah, all's good. Yeah, well, um, just wanted to let you know you're in, like, the best spot out of everyone, right? This alliance of five, it's, it's locked in. We're going to the final five, and when we get there, you'll essentially be a swing vote between two duos, so you got a lot of power. Why are you telling me that? Well, you know, um, because people are concerned you're gonna flip. Hmm. Well, that's maybe what happened. What do you mean? Well, I was in the shelter and I heard you guys talking, and you said that was a good little four you got, so am I the fifth? No, you're, you're not the fifth, Rebecca. Look, there's four people talking, so I said four people. If there was five people talking, I would have said five people. If there was three people, you, you, you get my point. Yeah, sure, Jack. I've got a lot to think about for tonight. My head's telling me, you know, just go with the five, stick with the group, and, you know, get to the end. But do I want to do that? Do I just want to stick with one alliance for the entire game, one that I'm not even sure is going to keep me around to the end? I don't know. Do I want to flip to something as unstable as, like, an alliance with Sydney? I don't know. I really don't know what to do tonight. Welcome, survivors, to Tribal Council. Now introducing the member of our jury, Brooke. Voted off at the last Tribal Council. So, Sydney, last round, you played an idol, and you negated six votes. Do you think that tonight you could be in danger again? Oh, definitely, Jeff. I feel like nothing's really changed. I'm still a target, and, well, I could easily be on home tonight. Hmm. How about you, Jasmine? You picked up votes last tribal. How are you feeling? I'm feeling scared. In this game, it's like anything can happen, so you gotta be prepared. That is true. Seth, you want immunity. Do you think that helps your game or hurts it? I'd say it helps it. I'm safe tonight, so, you know, all's good. I feel fine. All right, with that, it is time to vote. Toby, you can start us off. Well, I'd rather it be Sydney tonight, but hey, I'm fine with voting you off too. Max, I'm really hoping it's your time to go tonight. I have tallied the votes. If anyone has a hidden immunity idol and would like to play it, now would be the time to do so. No? Alright, once the vote's read, the decision is final. The person voted off will be asked to leave the Tribal Council area immediately. I'll read the votes. First vote. Max. Second vote. Max. Third vote. 
Jasmine. That's two votes max, one vote Jasmine. Jasmine. We're tied. Two votes max, two votes Jasmine, five votes left. Max. Sixth vote. Jasmine. That's three votes max, three votes Jasmine, three votes left. Seventh vote. Max. Eighth vote. Jasmine. We're tied. Four votes max, four votes Jasmine, one vote left. In the final vote, the eighth person voted off in the second member of our jury. Max. Max, that's five votes. That's enough for tonight. I'll need you to bring me your torch. Max, the tribe has spoken. It's time for you to go. Well, I'm kind of surprised to get voted off tonight. I expected the numbers to be with me. I didn't see anyone having a reason to flip. I don't know what I did wrong. Um, whoever flipped, I think, made a big mistake. And, well, if they get to the end, I'm not going to vote for them. I wish Jack the best of luck. Um, and whoever didn't flip on me, I'm not sure who it was. So, whoever they are, good luck. And hopefully, uh, they make it far.